Hello. In this video, we are going to discuss about concatenate and concatenate x function with the help of a simple example. So first, let us go to the Microsoft documentation page, review the syntax, and then try to implement them. So the definition and syntax is pretty simple. It joins two text strings into one text string. That's the definition. And syntax, it takes two parameters here, text one and text two. So it combines two text fields into one field and gives the string as a result. So let's go to the concatenex. Concatenates the result of an expression evaluated for each row in a table. So it takes three parameters, the table expression and delimiter. So basically what it does, uh, if you input a column has a reference here, it concatenates all the values in that particular column separated by a delimiter, okay? So maybe we can try to uh, experiment this in PBI. So let's quickly go to PBI. I have the sample data set here, customer ID, title, first name, and last name. I want to add title, first name, and last name into a single column. So how do we do that? So let me create a new field and then name it as concatenate equal to concatenate. I want to add title percent space and then I want to add this with the first name and then I can do this here so I want to bring the last name here I want a space between the first name and the last name. Hit enter. So now you can see with the help of a concatenate function, I'm able to get the title, first name and last name in a single column, okay? So this is how a concatenate works. If you want to combine uh, let's say more than two columns, you can use ampersand. So that's what I've done here. So I have the second parameter here and in my first parameter. So I used ampersand here to add the title and the first name into this text field and then combine this with the last name. So this is how I do. So now let's see the concatenate X function. Let's call this as a column. I'm going to show this in a measure as well. So concatenate X, table name here is employee details. Expression, let's say I want to add all the first name in, into a single cell, okay? So first name, delimiter, let's say a comma. So now if I hit enter, give it a second, it might take some time because it's a heavy query. It might consume a lot of resource. So as you can see now, this particular cell, right? It, what it does, it concatenates all the first names, so all the records, what is in the first name into a single cell. Okay, if I'm doing this, you know, column. So now let me try to do the same thing in, uh, so I have a table here. So in the values, I have just the title. So let me create a new measure here and then call this as 
concatenate x call this as a measure m okay so now what it does it adds all the data all the first name into a single cell and then you can see what are the uh, employees who are the employees belongs to this title let's say mr mrs etc so what i'm going to do here add concatenate x concatenate x uh, table name is employee details expression let me add the let me also add the title not required i think the first name and the last name let me add the first name and then i can use ampersand here with a space and then last name and then i want the delimiter as a comma and now hit enter so now if i bring this to the values here let me maximize this one okay i think okay this is better increase the size here now as you can see i have all the values in a single cell say so mr these are the people who belongs to this title so if i scroll down a bit right you can see here we have only few people who belongs to this category okay so you can see luis alvaro etc it's separated by a comma here so that's how we can get all the values into a single cell in this way you can see but the majority are in the mr and mrs category here so maybe if you are doing something like text mining and you want to get some all the values into a one cell and then see and then like a case notes or something this is this function is very useful hope it's clear so if you have any questions please drop me a note in the comment section so i can revert back to you okay hope this video was helpful and thanks for watching have a great day